I doing? I don't even know how to read. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh, oh. I love you. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh, oh. I love you. I do. Which one of you called in a pants fire? Hey, buddy. Hey. Ooh. Hey, I couldn't help but notice you uh, over on the sidewalk. Uh, it's been a rough day, and I can tell you, you're doing awful. Uh, I was wondering if you have a smoke on your What? Just a cigarette. I, you know, I had a rough day at the office. I gotta get rid of my Porsche. Yeah, I'm sorry, man. I was being a dick. I got smoke. It's all right, man. You're having a tough day. Oh, uh, yeah. Aren't we all? Yeah, I am. Listen, good luck with that. One thing I don't hate is Pop Tarts. <laughs> Victory feels nice. Victory feels great. No, I don't really consider myself a gamer. Gamers play multiple games. There's only one game for me, and only one year of its existence that I play. And that's John Madden Football 2004. One of my favorite things about Madden is definitely the fantasy draft. You never know where you're going to land up, and you don't know who you're going to be able to get. And I like to pick Packer players, but sometimes you just got to go with where you fall. It looks like in this draft, I fell to 23. And even though I'm a Packer fan, 
when you're playing Madden, you definitely got to go with Randy Moss. He is lights out. No one can cover him. You just send him deep, you're good to go. I'm sorry. Had to take Randy Moss. Best player available. Sometimes you got to do that. I mean, you're telling me that there's things more fun than this? What are you going to do? Go to, like, McDonald's and find, like, a $5 meal that's actually worth, you know, $80? Because that's what I just did. And here's one thing you can do when you're playing, uh... John Madden football. You can focus on the freaks, and here's a freak right here. Ooh, I haven't, I haven't taken an eagle yet. And here lies Michael Westbrook. Oh yeah, that's a good pick. Round 15. Oh, this is great. I love the fantasy draft. It's so awesome. I mean, a lot of people uh, hang out with friends and you know go on dates with women, and I just like why waste your time? You can just spend all your time in this fantasy world, and you can beat up on computer simulated people and you know they don't laugh at you or make fun of you or tell you that you know you're fat or hey why don't you shave you look like a slob you know I don't have to deal with that when I'm playing Madden and um, in Madden I'm the boss and I, I'm the one that makes fun of people not on the Packers but he was on the Packers and he helped them win a Super Bowl and I'm getting him in round 16 how can you not love doing this people in their real lives you know I don't know why you'd want to do that this is so much more fulfilling. I can sit here all day and I can go through an entire season of John Madden football and never leave my bed. You can find something more fun to do than this. I like to know about it because it's got to be pretty damn fun. Definitely one of my favorite things to do on here is create a player. I can put myself in the game. How real is that? I'd rather do this. This is action right now. I wish I was a football player, and I'm not a football player in real life. So you know how I make up for that? I put myself in the game. That's what it's all about, putting yourself in the game. I mean, just look at how tough he looks. No fat, pure muscle. Just an exaggeration of myself. It's not exactly fake, just an exaggeration. All right, look at this guy. He's a beast. All right, let's see what my player is. Overall 99 rating. Oh yeah, and when I get picked up, I'm gonna be worth 32.40 million dollars. Nice. I wish this was real life though. That'd be awesome, wouldn't it? If I actually made that much. Maybe get like a big screen TV and like have some friends over. That'd be cool. Well, he's a, a gold digger, he's digging for gold, you know, he's a gold digger, he's looking for more.